Well, I'm the poet, and uh, I get to read The Last Bohemian of Avenue A. I'm a sucker for begonias. Yeah, winter was hell, but now springtime tangos me into the night. And wine drinking t time, Rain wine drinking weather is here. Not that old rot gut with an indelible drawl. Roscoe, why are you gazing at me with a hard question in your eyes? We used to be happy as two lotus eaters could be without being counter-revolutionary in this secular season. Are you trying to read my mind again, huh? You look like Socrates begging for the hemlock, but you should be happy we have a rent control roof over our heads. The landlord would be elated to kick us out on the damn streets to eat caviar out of garbage cans, senor. You see, in this age, one man's troubles can be another man's foxtrot. Why are you looking at me like that, Roscoe? I know I gave you your prime cut and two green pills at daybreak. I know we gotta go to the vet and see why your eyes are changing color. I wish you could tell me if you see nothing but gray paradoxes, like a tomcat. Oh, man, do I have a surprise for you, and it doesn't have anything to do with a sunny bordella of whimsical needs. You have to know in your animal way, why I'm jumping up and down inside myself. I still see Seneca ghosts, and you can forget the tab I dropped with Burroughs and 79. That lost river under a fallen bridge. Oh boy, look at you. Once you were marked, numbered, and tagged at the pound. But since we've been hanging out all these years, you are now a mutt almost overtaken by the Lord's composure. Now, Sheila used to say, Johnny, one blue moon, you're gonna wish you never ran up and down these streets paved and brimstoned and tar. Look, my dog of a man, please stop dancing and just be a damn dog. Forget Sheila, she's soft and happy out in Orange, New Jersey, preening under a big cottonwood and sign over Clark Kent. I bet she hasn't touched that cello since we kiss and wave goodbye. With your little howl, we were a mind-bending trio. Do you want to 
You hear the tenor, the baritone, the alto, the soprano this morning. Did you notice they took down the bronze plaque off Yardbird's house? You supposed to see everything clear, near and far, high and low. I know the changing of colors can make one think he's one of Philip's soldiers returning from battle with his eyes plucked out. Now, the homeless on these broken streets cast Jesus as a socialist, thrashing money changers. These days, I lose myself in lush, plush public gardens, refusing to pretty up the agony of things. Are you still inside my train of thought? And sometimes, oh boy, we just don't know if the cut of a jacket is right. Look, why are you cocking your head that way, huh? You want to get out and chase your dream rabbit around the park double time? When are you going to use your amazing sixth sense against crooked laws of time and false luster? You look like you need another piece of juicy, fresh, bloody meat, the best money can buy. When I first saw Sheila, she rode a blue bike and posed over at the studio. She had walked in there and pulled that pale shift over her lovely head and then sat on the stool as a goddess on her throne. One night I said, look, I don't have a jealous bone in my body. And she grinned and said, you're not a good liar, Johnny. That somber sprung into a song I was born to carry beyond earthly dominion into coal burning towards forgiveness. Look, forget your three-fifths of a man psychosis. Cause you won't believe things seen and heard when the lights are turned down. Have I ever served you any processed meat or goulash out of tin cans? Maybe a silver blue quill every now and then spooked from a flaming bush. You eat good as a prince. Well, at least you're not the infamous scapegoat everyone calls brother, Roscoe. Would you please stop your jigging around this floor and if, as if you're all tied up and monkey me. I remember when you could still be out there in the dead cold, your tail uncurled like a grace note, happy as a wolf in snow. But now, what's left 
is only style. It's not a way of being. And my few friends, still alive, they are knocking on wood or damn good metaphysical detectives. <laughs>